Hello friends, as we kick off May term and look ahead to an exciting summer, I'm happy to share with you this report on a successful school year. At our recent scholarship and awards day, we were able to honor several deserving faculty members for their accomplishments during the past year. Dr. Howard Finch was the recipient of the Jennings B. Marshall Undergraduate Teaching Award. Not only is he an incredibly effective, engaging, and genuine instructor, he was selected for his diligent work to design and establish curriculum for our new real estate concentration. At the graduate level, we were honored to award Dr. Steve Jones with the Robert W. Bill Service Graduate Teaching Award. Dr. Jones consistently earns strong student evaluations with regular feedback about his ability to increase student engagement and make finance courses understandable. Not only do our faculty excel in teaching, but they are also noteworthy scholars. This year, Dr. Joy Buchanan received our Jero Hodges Research Award. Since 2020, she has had five works published in scholarly journals, all of which have less than 15% acceptance rate. She's also had one book chapter and numerous other online contributions published. Her work is making advances in the understanding of high-tech labor markets, charitable giving, and wage bargaining in a recession. We also had a chance to honor Dr. Matt Maisie with this year's Laren C. Harper Service Award. Dr. Maisie has worked extensively with Sanford's Center for Sports Analytics, while also providing mentorship for students in the Sanford Startup Incubator Program. Additionally, Dr. Maisie has served on 10 different school and university standing and ad hoc committees over the last several years, as well as participated in numerous professional service opportunities with academic organizations and scholarly journals. Throughout the year, our students have participated in noteworthy projects and research across all disciplines. A few notable highlights include Brock scholar Lauren Dumars winning research at the Association of Private Enterprise Education's 12th Annual Undergraduate Research Competition. Lauren, who is continuing in our Masters of Accountancy program, was also the recipient of the university's Velma Wright Irons Award for the second highest cumulative GPA across campus. Bill Mouché, who graduated with a double major in economics and finance, was the third Sanford student in a row to be selected for the American Enterprise Institute's Young Scholars Program. Bill recently defended his research at the AEI headquarters in Washington, D.C. At spring commencement, Bill was one of two business graduates to receive the university's John C. Pittman Service Award. The other was finance major Cooper Scholl. Our sports marketing program continues to flourish. Students finished the marketing research project for the Denver Broncos last fall, and many of them are currently in England presenting research to executives of an international soccer club. Additionally, this year's sports marketing cohort was the largest signing class we've had, with job placements with 12 regional, national, and international sports brands. This has been a milestone year for the school as we're celebrating 15 years of formerly being known as the Brock School of Business. We're also celebrating 15 years of the Student Managed Bulldog Fund. Lastly, we're also honored to be ranked by Fortune Education as the number 26 online MBA program in the country. As we say goodbye to an incredible year, we say congratulations to Professors Alan Blankley and Jim Rabel. I'm especially grateful for their dedication to Sanford and the Brock School of Business for a combined 35 years. We will all miss their friendship on campus, but we wish them the best as they enter their well-deserved season of retirement. Finally, I want to say thank you to our advisory board members, alumni, families, and friends for your continued support. It's because of your love for the Brock School that we're able to continue our path developing the next generation of Christian business leaders. All of the great things that have happened here in Cooney Hall this year are not possible without your faithful support and encouragement. Thank you and have a wonderful summer.